SETI, Search for Extraterrestrial Intelligence, detected a strange radio signal from Proxima Centauri. Astronomers have spotted what may be the strongest candidate yet for an alien signal. Researchers at the Breakthrough Listen Project have found an unusual beam of radio light coming from around our nearest neighboring star, Proxima Centauri. According to a report in The Guardian on the 18th of December, they spotted something strange mysterious signals that appear to be coming from the direction of the star Proxima Centauri. Proxima Centauri is the closest star to the Sun, a small red star roughly 4.2 light years away. Scientists confirmed at least two Earth like rocky planets orbit the Proxima Centauri. Any purported discovery of aliens always has to be taken with skepticism. That is especially true in cases where a signal appears to be a possible techno signature, a sign of alien technology rather than simply life beyond Earth. The Breakthrough Listen team has been extremely cautious about this find. No one is claiming it's a techno signature, tweeted Pete Worden, chairman of the Breakthrough Prize Foundation. In fact, the researchers aren't claiming much about it at all. News of the signal came to light by a researcher speaking to The Guardian before the scientific paper on it has been published. The data analysis isn't yet complete. So nobody can be sure exactly what this strange radio beam is. All we know so far is that it is peculiar. The Breakthrough Listen team has detected several unusual signals and is carefully investigating, Worden tweeted. The strongest and most persistent are all from Proxima. The team detected several signals while examining data gathered by the Parkes Observatory in Australia in a 2019 search for stellar flares from Proxima Centauri. Nearly all of the signals flagged by Breakthrough Listen's algorithms as potential extraterrestrial beacons turned out to be from human-made technology like satellites, except for one. This odd signal lasted about three hours and was concentrated in a very narrow range of wavelengths, a range that isn't generally used by our satellites and spacecraft. It was the first signal to pass through Breakthrough Listen's first round of checks which are mainly designed to weed out signals that actually originate from Earth. The researchers have named it Breakthrough Listen Candidate 1, or BLC-1. BLC-1 is a candidate study radio signal announced in December 2020, possibly coming from the star Proxima Centauri. The signal has a frequency of 982.002 MHz and an apparent shift in its frequency is consistent with the Doppler effect caused by the movement of Proxima b, a planet of Proxima Centauri. Astronomers were using the Parkes telescope in Australia. The signal was observed in April and May last year. The source of the signal still remains unclear. The same signal has not been spotted again since the initial observation. The signal could be coming from one of the two rocky planets of Proxima Centauri. Proxima Centauri is a cool, small red dwarf star. It means the habitable zone is much closer to the star. That is why these planets are likely exposed to dangerous radiation. So the mysterious signal could be coming from a natural cosmic source. The radio signal was detected during 30 hours of observations conducted by Breakthrough Listen through the Parkes Observatory in Australia in April and May 2019. As of December 2020, follow-up observations have failed to detect the signal again. A step necessary to confirm that the signal was a techno signature. However, Worden urged caution and stressed that the Breakthrough Listen team still believes these signals will turn out to be radio interference from earthly technology, rather than contact from an alien civilization. All previous signals the team has detected have been quickly explained by Breakthrough Listen's first round of tests. But the researchers will have to run additional checks they have never used before on this new signal, says Jason Wright at Pennsylvania State University. 
they are running those checks now. If it is truly a signal from Proxima Centauri, that is interesting not only because it is our solar system's nearest stellar neighbor at just 4.2 light years away, but also because we know that it has at least two planets. Proxima is also neat, because some people have speculated that if there is a lot of technology in the galaxy and if you wanted to communicate over long distances, sending the signal directly is a pretty inefficient way to do it, says Wright. It's like how if I call you on the phone, my mobile phone is not directly sending your phone a radio signal. The idea is that advanced aliens would be more likely to set up a network that could look somewhat like an interstellar cell phone system. With many interconnected nodes relaying messages across the galaxy. If extraterrestrial civilizations are doing that, we wouldn't expect to get a lot of signals from distant stars, we'd expect to find them from nearby stars, says Wright. We will know whether BLC-1 is just earthly interference in the next few months after breakthrough listen researchers run more tests and officially publish their investigations. Even if they rule out interference from our own satellites or spacecraft, astronomers will run through many other possible explanations before they conclude it is aliens. The team will be keeping a close eye on our closest neighbor. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe for more videos.